What's up guys, Mr. Golden Thumbs here, and today we've got our week 5 matchup in our franchise builder series. This week, we're taking on the New Orleans Saints, who are surprisingly 2-2, two and two, which I didn't really expect, but it happens. Right now, we're sitting at 4-0, and oh. we're on top of our division in the NFC South. And Jameis Winston has been leading this team to victories. Last week, we had a statement win against the Pittsburgh Steelers, showing that we can beat teams by more than three points. Now, let's get into this Week 5 matchup. The New Orleans Saints are 85 overall. We're at 80 overall. And I'll see you guys once this game has started. Hopefully, Jameis Winston can get off to a good start week Looks five. Looks like we're set back to return once again week five. And Russell Shepard has 333 yards returning. And I think a 29-yard kick return average. That is crazy. Anyways, let's get to it. We're going to try and go with the power first play of the game. It looks like they're blitzing. Don't know if we'll be get something out of it. No, actually, not going to be too bad. Throw it incomplete on that second down. Almost had Safarian Jenkins. He was wide open. This time, we've got Vincent Jackson, though. And he's going to get that first down. Down to the 40. When you call a play too fast, like, without even seeing what it is, because you're trying to skip the damn animations after a play. Anyways, third and six. Let's try the screen here. Hopefully, they bring the pressure. They do. Come on. You guys got to block that guy. But still, going to get a good pickup. tired from carrying the ball too much already, so no shot Moreno's in. This time, let's try and hit Safari and Jenkins again, and hopefully we don't miss him. Uh, they've got the cut. Whoa, come on. He got stuck in between the backer and the defensive lineman. That has to be a pass interference, but you know EA's not going to right here on fourth and three. We need to put up a statement. We need the points to start off our first drive. Safarian Jenkins is open, and he's going to make the catch for the first down. Good play call right there. Getting us a first down on fourth down. on that last run, but all good. Second and three. We'll take it. We've got Y open. Murphy Jr. getting us a nice short completion for the first down. They got lucky they tipped that ball because that was a sure touchdown. But this time, we're going power to the left. Get me a block. And no Sean Moreno powered through a tackle, but he's going to get caught for a one-yard pickup. Down, nine yards out. We've taken almost the whole quarter for this drive. Eee, man, that was close. I didn't think he was going to catch up to that one. But Safarian Jenkins is going to make the huge grab in the end zone, getting us a seven-point lead. Wow, okay, did you guys just see that animation? He just kind of, like, glided towards the ball because of the animation. Because that was way overthrown. Coming out and cover two, man. Oh, man. All right, their running game is going to be pretty damn good. Mark Ingram's a good running back. He's going to be hard to... Handle right, so we today. forced our first third down here. Can we get a stop? Third and two. They're probably going to run it. Of course they run it. And we're going to get the stop one yard short of that first down. The blitz paid off right there. Levante David got in the backfield and just stopped Mark Ingram right like in his brought a lot of pressure on that first down. So let's try and hit him with the screen. Make him pay for bringing pressure. I don't get why the offensive linemen just keep running instead of blocking the guy that's Let's go right there. Let's deep in on third and 13. Looking to hit Vincent Jackson. Let's call Max Protect here. They're bringing pressure, but we're going to hit. Oh, my. Damn it. He was open. Just wasn't put in the right place. Is that Reggie Bush playing on defense? Come on. I know that wasn't my zone. What are you guys doing? You've got to be kidding me. 
In cover three press, what is my corner doing running up the goddamn field like that? We really screwed up on that last offensive possession. We had the open receiver, just didn't throw the ball in the right position. It's now 7-7 seven seven because our defense played like a bunch of soft motherfuckers. Now we've got Safarian Jenkins open, and he's going to get us a huge gain on first down, down to the 38-yard line. This guy is a weapon on our offense. We couldn't do without him, and no one could cover him on first down. Ended up getting nothing. Let's get Mike Evans this time. He got held, but he's going to get the catch. Close to the first down. We have a minute 35 to try and score here. Let's see if Vincent Jackson can get open on this route. Oh, man. That's just a little bit overthrown. But he was open. trying to cross deep once again. Last time it was a very long conversion. This time maybe we'll be able to get something out of it. And once again. God damn it. Once again, we right, get they're definitely off. going for a pass right here. Let's bring this guy on some pressure. God damn it. I took Brandon Spikes out of that play. Our defense really needs to improve is our cornerbacks. I mean, our defensive backs are terrible. They're never in good position. I don't even think we have one interception yet this season. Up last week. I don't know why they don't want to step up this week. It's kind of pissing me off, actually. God damn. Another big hit in the legs. But not forcing any Levante David, but to the wrong side. Should have blitzed Brandon Spikes instead. It's pissing me off. Our defense is not stepping up. Let's blitz both linebackers. Second and three. And none of them are going to be there. CJ Spiller, what the hell? Second and goal from the two. They're probably running the ball right here. This defense is so bad. That offensive line needs to learn to block, for real. And what? Come on, you got to hold on to that goddamn ball. Second down, but the receiver's going to drop it. Bring it up another third down. Let's get the tight end. Safarian Jenkins is going to catch him, though. That's why we only throw it right here after getting that first down. Hoping they bring pressure. They do. Can we get a block? Come on. Receivers just running everywhere and not making blocks. That pisses me off. In the third. We really need some points on this drive. Safarian Jenkins once again. Let's go wide action. open. Let's try not to throw another interception close to the end zone. <laughs> You're fucking kidding me. I lead him inside. And he's... Or actually, I lead him outside. Because he's running that way, but... What the hell? Our game today. We're playing pretty goddamn bad. There's a lot of extra weight out there for this jumbo set. And here's the toss. The defense can't stop anyone. The offense can't do anything. We really need this stop right here to keep our hopes alive, or else I'm pretty sure this one is over. Offense lines up here. The Saints from the 32. We brought the pressure and it pays off. Getting the sack and we're getting so we the get ball a pretty back. damn good punt return. Almost was a touchdown if we could have broken that last tackle. But we need some points here and we need them fast. Finally, we get a screen with some blocks. And we're gonna get a huge pickup right there. And this is what we must convert, even though fourth down will be going for it for sure. I don't know who that guy is, but man, he needs to catch that goddamn he ball. Caught right there. So we have another fourth down coming up. Another cross deep this time. And Vincent Jackson is going to get it this time. Let's go. No huddle. Nice throw off right there. He was open. Couldn't connect. Third and six. Third down and six. Safarian Jenkins. 
And he's going to take it into the end zone, making it a three-point game with three minutes left to go in the fourth. to try and put up three points, and this is where our defense needs to step up right here. Most important part of the game. And that's not what I call stepping up. Come on! Keep running it because their run game is working. Oh no, they're going to be passing on this one. We're going to bring pressure with Levante David. God damn it, defense! Linebacker. Because they're not playing in coverage anyways, and they're not tackling. Come on. This is some bullshit. Finally, a nice little sack there. Third and goal. We need the stop right here. And we're going to get the stop. We're going to call a timeout. Three points on that last defensive series. We're down six. We need seven to win. 145 left to go. Let's see if Jameis Winston can lead the comeback. First down at the 21. Gonna try and scramble now. Harrelson. Thank you for getting down on that play. Every play is huge. We picked up six yards. We're gonna run the same play. Hoping, hoping they change up their coverage. They're not. Let's hit Mike Evans. Let's keep going. First down. Pressure on every snap. We're going to go play action with the rollout this time. And we've got the backup tight end. He gets hurt. But he made the catch. Second and six. What? How did he catch that? Run, run. What? You're kidding me. He was definitely down. No. You've got to be kidding me. Please tell me he was down. That better get reviewed, man. That if if we don't get that ball back, that's the game. If that's a fumble, EH has screwed us like never before. And it's getting reviewed. Thank God. Please give us that damn ball back after that nice play. To me, it looks like he's down. Oh, thank God. Thank you, Madden Gods. We make a sick play right there. Somehow our receiver caught that. Oh my god, we've got 44 seconds left. I gotta shut up. Let's go with the 0-1 trap. But we make it. I don't know how he caught that in coverage. Gets so close to the end zone. And let's 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 go. One yard to go. And we've got three more downs. We need to go in single back ace. We're bringing in Noshawn Moreno. 0 oh, 1 trap. 10 seconds left to go. And we're going to get into the end zone. And we take the lead with 5 seconds left in this game. Wow. We came up with some big plays in that last 2 minutes. And this could be the game for us. We can take another this is victory. Definitely the last play of the game right here. Two seconds left. We're winning by one. We need a stop. We can't let them get anything. And there you have it, folks. We take the win 21 to 20. Jameis Winston leading the comeback win in the last two minutes. The winning drive, and Noshawn Moreno took it in from one yard out to get us that touchdown. We almost had a controversial fumble, but thankfully it was reviewed, and we got the ball back to finish this game off. And man, 
We've had so many close games this season. It's so stressful. <laughs> but we win one by one. And we managed to stay undefeated. And still lead the NFC South. Player of the game is going to the receiver that made that last catch. I'm not sure who it was. We're going to go check right Shepherd now. Shepard is the one that made that final catch, taking it for 42 yards. He did fumble, but the call was reversed. He made that huge grab to get us all the way into scoring position. So, Russell Shepard, my man. Well, Russell? I said Russell. Russell Shepard, my man. You are the player of the game. You stepped up. You, you got one catch for 42 yards, bro. I mean, definitely the player of the game for me today. Defense sucked ass. Offense sucked ass. But Russell Shepard stepped up when we needed someone to and step guys, up. That's going to be it for me on this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Also, make sure to leave a like for the undefeated season so far. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Until next time, I'm out.